Happy Memorial Day. All right, I really hope you can hear me above all the street noise and everything. Um, I have been in my house all weekend, so I really just needed to take a walk and get out somewhere. So I came up with this idea to do a landmark challenge. Um, Eric and uh, Alex, you guys can go to Milwaukee. I, like, you don't have to do this right away, just as soon as you can. Um, I have one idea in particular in Milwaukee that I'd like to see in the background of one of you guys, but uh, just like go out and like show you know a little bit of your piece of the Midwest. I'm at the Ohio State House, which I guess is a little relevant considering it's Memorial Day. And uh, yeah, I'm in. Took a walk. I'm downtown. It's a really windy, humid, weird day, and I think it's gonna thunderstorm any second. So I'm gonna try to make this quick. My worst vacation experience was one that I took with my dad. God, I hope you can hear me over the wind. Um, we went up north to the Two-Hearted River. Um, it's a river that Ernest Hemingway has written about um, before. And we went on a tubing trip. Well, we went to this random like little shack. It was like the only store within like, I swear, 100 miles or something. It was ridiculous. And uh, I really wanted, it was really thirsty. It was a really hot day and I wanted a cold lemonade. So I reached into the, um, the cooler they had with all the drinks and they were all warm. So I kept reaching further and further back. And then all of a sudden I hear this awful grinding sound and I feel a sharp pain in up my hand. Yeah, the fan wasn't covered in the back that was the cooling mechanism and it was covered in like black like oil or grease or something and so it like nearly took the tip of my finger off and if that wasn't bad enough then it was just like covered in like grease and stuff so my dad had to clean it out for me in the bathroom and it was probably like the worst like painful experience ever like he had to like hold me because I was like trying to run away on top of that it was a horrible it was like fly black fly season so when we went to the beach like we were just bitten like all over by black flies and then also when we went tubing, I got caught, I got snagged by my swimming trunks on a branch and got taken under and he had to like swim up like 10 meters, like up screen to like come and like dive under and rescue me. Like I came really close to drowning. So yeah, great, great experience. We bonded, but you know, not in the best terms. What am I proud of, Amy? Well, I usually say the whole living abroad, you know, making, making all new friends, like being away from my family everything but like it's time to like move on and look at my life you know stop living in the past so what am I proud of I'm proud of getting my degree I'm proud of sticking it through and making it through college because that was really hard for me and I'm proud of getting a job that's relevant to my um, studies and on top of that of finally being completely financial um, financially dependent um, independent rather <laughs> Shelby I I had an idea about this gift thing. Um, I think it'd be great to have the $10 limit or even just do stuff that we already have laying around that might remind us of that person. I don't think we should have any guidelines for what we give. I think that we should just, you know, anything that reminds us of them or of ourselves to give to them. And uh, I was thinking that we can do it this way. Um, I will start hopefully soon and send something out to all of you guys. And so we'll have one week where you each receive a gift from me. And then the following week, everybody will receive a gift from Amy. And it'll just be a really fun thing to do that way if you guys agree. Eric, besides smoking, um, God, there aren't any bad habits I have that I really want to share with you two. I have a lot. I have an addictive personality, and um, I know I'm not a heroin addict. I guess burping, like in public, like I have a hard time holding it in because I have a hiatal hernia, which means my stomach is slightly twisted askew, and it causes like a lot of tra trapped air. And so like when I'm at home, like I burp constantly, it just, I have to, otherwise I get really bad stomach pains. And uh, yeah, so sometimes I'll completely forget about like surroundings and I'll like let out a belch and then feel really bad about it because I don't like to belch in front of people. Alex, my favorite ride, I had to think about this, it would probably be the Iron Dragon at Cedar Point and a huge factor into picking this would be the line that you have to wait in because I hate waiting in lines like my idea of like ultimate success if I ever reach it someday is to never have to wait in a single line like to just be so important and so well known that you know, you can skip right to the front and nobody will say anything to you because you're you. Yeah, the Iron Dragon, you still get a really nice rush. It's kind of short, but you can just hop back on again. I can't wait to go to Cedar Point. I already talked about a challenge, so I'm just gonna take, uh, my papers are blowing away. I'm gonna take the last opportunity to tell you, um, to talk to the subscribers a bit. You guys, we've kind of hit a subscriber standstill. I don't know if you noticed. Um, it's kind of hurting me a little bit. Like, I really appreciate the subscribers that you have because I think they're the best. I think you guys, seriously, you, here between us, but I would like it to be more.
more interactive. And I'd like to hear from more of you that don't comment so often. And we want to hear from you and like what can make this channel better? Like what would you like to see? What changes would you make so that it's more interactive? And what do you think would help us bring in more subscribers? Like do you have any ideas? Because we've been racking our brains and we cannot come up with anything. So you know, please leave a video response if you can. Um, that would be the best way to go about it. But definitely text comments too. Um, I only got seven last video and it kind of made me sad. So leave a text comment, especially just to tell us like what you would do to the channel to make it better. I'm gonna go before I either get rained on or blowed away by the wind. So um, have a great week. Happy Memorial Day again. Uh, the city's really dead right now. It's kind of creepy. Uh, but yeah, bye.